your life, Lois. Now, wait a minute. Captain America might show up, too. He'd never let her come out here alone. You're right. Get your hands up. Badly hurt, but still alive. We'll have to get him to a doctor right away if we want to save him and find the scar. Bart Matson, who was captured last night by Captain America after a desperate fight, has been positively identified as the criminal who abducted Dr. Lyman and stole his world famous life restoring machine. Fatally injured in the battle, Matson is now in the home sanitarium on the verge of death. Attending physicians hope that he may revive sufficiently to speak. If he does, the district attorney is anxious to question him about that master criminal, Miss Carrot. That's one talk even if he is dying. I know that, but he's our most valuable man. If he dies, we'll have to change all our plans. No, we won't. As a matter of fact, I plan to get his body before it reaches the morgue. But Maxon's dead body can be of no use to us. No. But restore to life it can. I'll make arrangements to recover the body. And when we do, I'll force Dr. Lyman to perform an experiment that will amaze even the district attorney. What's the latest on that? It's getting worse. The doctors have lost all hope of saving his Oh, yes, Commissioner. Dr. Black just phoned me from the sanitarium. Matson is dead. I've ordered the guards removed, and the county morgue will pick up the body. Well, that's unfortunate. Maxim's death robs us of the best lead we ever had to Mascara. But the search must go on for Dr. Lyman. Put every available man on the job. Okay, Grant. We better go down to the sanitarium and talk to Dr. Black. It's just possible that Maxim made some delirious remark, which may help us locate Dr. Lyman. Cut it off. As soon as my men recover Matson's body, it will be brought here. You will resurrect him with your life-restoring machine. But I didn't construct this machine to bring a murderer back to life. And besides, it would take a million volts of electrical energy before this machine would be effective on a man. Well, fortunately, I read your comments on the operation of your machine. And I've been able to supply everything you may require. Come. I'll show you. Open up the panel. This apparatus, Dr. Lyman, is capable of generating all the electricity you can possibly need. Set the control for one million volts. Throw the generator switch. If you refuse to revive,
Clive Matson. Your last moments will be spent in there, Dr. Lyle. Yes? Oh, yes, Gruber. Very well, we'll be ready. You won't have long to wait, Doctor. My men report that the morgue truck has just arrived at the home sanitarium. try to claim the body. If they do, I'll have them trail. We'll go to the morgue and make the necessary arrangements. All right, you two. Start walking and don't look back. before he died. I'll have Davis check on that. GG calling WD. GG calling WD. Come in, GG. The morgue wagon was hijacked. An automobile with the license number 1B7744 may be involved. Have the commissioner send out a general alarm to locate the car, but make no arrest. I'll handle this case myself. I'm on my way back to the office now. Okay, Chief. I just want to verify this number. 1B7744. Get the machine ready. Experiment. Turn the generator on to full capacity. That car belongs to the Electronic Researchers Limited. It's located in front of the terminal building where that company has its office and shop. Fine. That's all I want to know.
Well, that should be enough for now. Ready for the serum now. I'm a Captain America, will have captured both of you. His eyelids are fluttering. Thank you. 